Hello there YouTube gamers, this is your rambling gamer with another feature of handhelds. I love handhelds. And back in the day it was actually kind of a trick to be able to play your Game Boy in the dark. If you look here, here's the original. Let's let's see this. Yeah. This this is Nintendo. If you if you can't see that, that's that's Nintendo. <laughs> no, I mean it did the trick. For sure, you were able to play it. You could adjust the uh, the darkness of the screen. There were options on the Game Boy to make it uh, easier to see. But outside of that, as the generation started to come out with new Game Boys, so did the attachments. Let's see, you got the original Game Boy Color here, and if I turn this on, you can see that it is in color, but there's no backlight so with something like this you put this right on top and you got your magnifying glass All right, see that now for this one unfortunately the the lights are right here uh, I tried replacing the batteries but I gotta figure out why this one isn't working but luckily I do have the one for the Game Boy Advance that is pretty much the same deal here we are with the Mad Cat's attachment for, like I said, the Game Boy Advance. Now, it kind of simulates a dark room or a room without the lights on, door closed. If you just put it like that, you can see you don't really get to see anything. I do, however, need the batteries for this. Let's find the one that has it already in there. Come here, you. Come here now. What are you doing? Why are you hiding from me? I'm shy. Here you go. Alright. See, they can't see nerfing. We turn it on. Still can't see a whole lot of nothing. But, which we hit the hit the button. There we go. Look at that. Now, if you are in a dark room, you can now keep going with whatever your favorite game is. And this one was cool because it had the magnifying glass with it. So it was kind of a twofer. Made the screen a little bit bigger, easier to see, and it lit it. But not all of them uh, felt the need to put the glass on. I have two of those I could show off on this bad boy. Let's go ahead and move on to the next one. If this looks familiar, to me this just really seems to be the optimal setup to share my retro goodies uh, in, in YouTube videos in general. To, I love my collecting, but more than that, I love sharing the collection. Uh, anyway, here is this one. This comes from good old GameStop back in the day. So, they do have the bragging rights of being out long, uh, being out so long that they actually made attachments for the Game Boy Advance. Because this would not go on the Game Boy SP. So you can see this one is an automatic light. So you can turn that automatic feature off and just have it always on. So that you don't have to worry about it. And if you found that, if, if it personally you didn't like the magnifying glass, uh, this is def an easy way to get around it. Uh, I, I really don't know how much this was back in the day. I would think maybe about 20 bucks, maybe. But it's a cool option, and it's from GameStop. So it's kind of a fun little attachment. But on to my favorite one. This is my favorite one. Right here. This is the Gamester. We found this at Goodwill for $4.99. There's the price tag right there in case you were wondering. So I'm going to take my Game Boy Advance. It's a little tight, but don't be scared. There we go. Now if you look at it, it kind of, overall, it kind of makes it a little bit beefier. Right? And what's cool is once the light comes on, you don't even really have to use it. Just leave it on so that, look at that. Somebody's like, hey, I got a Game Boy Advance. I'm like, yeah, does it look like that? Bam! Look at that. I like that a lot. Uh, but to use it on the light, you fold it up here. Boom. Now it's right there. And if you need a carrier handle, 
case you don't want to uh, touch the screen or whatever if you're all hardcore super hardcore but this is definitely the highlight of my collection when I I passed this one up I was looking at something else on a shelf and it was the very awesome girlfriend that was like why did you did you, did you not want this I'm like, yes I want this and we have one more one more this is the one that I found I'm very happy about let's go ahead and oh look at this I don't even need to unattach it this right here is very cool it runs off the power that the advance from the batteries on the Game Boy Advance so you don't have to have a extra set of batteries oh it doesn't even come off but give me two seconds so that's what's cool about that attachment too it just slides so quick right off here we go and this one it's a party look at that <laughs> not only does it light up it's bendable adjustable you can aim it wherever you want and it kind of looks like one of those spaceships from War of the Worlds the original people who had a Game Boy back in the day will remember that this is not a, a prank. So that that one's pretty cool too. But I still I still like the wraparound one the best. And I hope that uh, if you were having any problems playing Game Boy in the dark, that this shows you some options on what you can do to rectify that situation, uh, or you can just go and buy the Game Boy SP and you sidestep all of that because it is backlit it's wonderful you have the game gear also back there that is backlit but and games are a little harsh little little hard to find beauty in i'm sorry but not with these wonderful things so i just wanted to share this bit of my collection uh and if you notice there's the weekly kind of game trailers those have gone kind of to the side because I'm doing so much over on Twitch. If you ever want to catch me live streaming games, I'm doing uh, retro games, Game Boy games, Game Boy Color games, uh, GameCube game, original Xbox, PlayStation 2, Xbox 360, Xbox One, and Wii games. Uh, all of that is a daily occurrence over at my channel on Twitch. Just look for The Rambling Gamer as you do here on YouTube and I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you enjoyed the walk around uh, how we had the ability to play Game Boy in the dark and I hope that you have a very 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 good day and I'll see you on the next video I'm your rambling gamer goodbye oh like and subscribe <laughs> bye